If the wards are short of medicines and materials, they should use private funds from cancer organizations, churches, individuals, and even patients and their families to cover everything they can. Those who refuse to accept bribes often have to work exhausting hours in the public health sector and overtime in the most lucrative private sector to fill this gap. The directive prohibits the prescription of comprehensive medicines to cancer patients who are legally entitled to free treatment. Since Romania has one of the lowest prices for medicines in the European Union, distributors in Romania buy medicines at low prices and then sell them at higher prices in other parts of Europe. It was there, after a busy day, that my legs, knees, legs and lower back were so badly hurt that I thought I should have lost hope for our next ascent. The Rainbow Mountain. That night I took a small bottle of magnesium butter, which a friend gave me before I left on my trip. Everything is in my hands. The Metallica Charitable Foundation made a donation to the Daru Yeste Viata Association, specializing in oncology and modernizing hospitals in Romania. Although required by law, the authorities must prove that the use of medicines that are not available in Romania was necessary to put an end to this practice. Unfortunately, it is not easy to get medicines, and many cancer patients including children, are dying. Instead, doctors and individuals should illegally collect donations and buy the necessary medicines. In March 2019, Falcon Insight reported that children with cancer die unnecessarily due to a lack of medication. Doctors do not have access to the medicines their patients need. I've come a long way from being the director of a non-profit organization that runs marathons, rock climbing, hiking, canoeing and canoeing, to being fully bedridden and watching the wall for 15 hours a day. Many patients will want to personally pay their doctors for the best care. Those who oppose corruption must leave the country in search of work. The new Romanian Children's Hospital will reduce the burden on families with sick children.